How's it going guys? If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, turn on the notification button if you like great content like this. And I do all this from Share Factory from your PlayStation, so that's why the footage is A-OK -okay sometimes and sometimes it's not that great. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to cut my mic off and let y'all listen to the story and what this game is about. It's Call of Duty 2, you know, well, Rule 2 basically what it is. I was about to say basically, but that's exactly what this is. So guys, without further ado, here comes the, uh, the footage. A struggle to preserve our civilization and to set free a suffering humanity. Our sons, pride of our nation, lead them straight and cruel. Their road will be long and hard. Men's souls will be shaken with the violences of war in this hour of great sacrifice. We shall prevail. Paul. It's June 6, 1944. Wish you could see this, brother. We're invading some frog beach I'm not supposed to even know the name of. Also, we can take back France from the Nazis. But the waiting's been half the battle. So he asked me for my watch, and I'm thinking, what the hell do you want my watch for? You're the captain of the goddamn football team. But I turned. I made some good buddies in basic, and they're all on the boat with me. Everybody's scared as hell, but nobody's letting on. I hated Zussman the first week of basic, but now he's probably the best friend I have in the world. He's always looking for trouble. If there wasn't already a war on, he'd be off trying to start one. Besides, I gotta keep all my fingers. I'm gonna take photo of the year. Styles says he's gonna be a photographer for Life magazine. Kind of looks like Clark Kent, so when he takes off his glasses, the only thing that happens is he can't see shit. Aello's the vet, but being honest, he's what Ma would call a bit of a rube. Okay. Let's make this more interesting. St. Michael, patron saint of soldiers. He's at my back since Kasserine. So it's been three times in ten seconds, and he's all yours. I don't know. Oh, you could always puss out. My money's on Zussman. Okay. I'm in. I can't watch. Just time me when I tell you. Back to my story. Me and my boys, we muscle our way into this poker game that the football team has going. We worked out a system where they can signal to me everybody's hands. You should have seen the QB's face when I took that pot. You ready? Mm -hmm. That's what happens when you try to hustle a hustler. Now. You get flushed. No freaking. Hello had enough fight in him for two men. Ma said never shake hands with a Jew. That's not what she said last night. And enough bigotry for six. Man, who needs a stupid pendant anyway? Apparently you did. Yeah. I'm gonna give me something better. A real chore. We'll see. Good luck with that. Oh! Briefing's at 1800. We're gonna be late. I got us covered, Daniels. Don't worry about it. Briefing's about to start. What the hell are you boys doing? Then there's Sergeant Pearson, a real sweetheart. Well, you think you're special, huh? The Krauts are going to eat your lunch. And not our lunch, Sergeant. Our lunch is secure. Watch your lips, Usman. On me. Since I'm obviously on a lucky streak, whatever happens, stay close. First Normandy, then the Rhine. We got this, Daniels.
Today, with our allies, we embark on an operation of unparalleled importance to establish a beachhead at Normandy and roll back the German aggression that has terrorized Europe for the past five years. We are all that separates the world from darkness. This, so much more than a chance to be heroes in our own lifetimes. If we prevail, our triumph will be etched into the hearts and minds of a grateful world for untold generations. I'm talking about glory, gentlemen. True glory. Colonel Davis sure can't give a nice speech. His pep talk reminded me of the one Coach Johnson gave us on our Thanksgiving Day game versus Austin. I'm sure you remember we lost that game by 42 points. Always looking over Pearson's shoulders, Lieutenant Turner. He's got him on a tight leash. But if Pearson breaks free, we'll all get bit. Ever since I could hold a rifle, I wanted to be like you, Paul. You've always been a tough act to follow. But I'm damn sure gonna try. It's now or never. Hey, I wish I was coming home to her. Yeah, just wait till we hit Paris. Seems like a long way off. Remember, no digging in at the shore. You've got to advance. You need to stay low and do not bunch up. Stick to your training, you're going to make it through. I'm proud to lead you fellas into battle. Anytime, anywhere. All right, give them hell, boys. The beaches are supposed to be flattened, right? Sounds scared, Private. No, sir. You should be. Daniel, got a light? Sure thing. Everybody down! Watch out! Get down! 500 yards! We're gonna have to pull off! No! We stay on mission! You're taking us in! We must have drifted! I can't see the landmark! You heard the lieutenant! Full speed! They're coming! Hold tight! God damn it! 200 yards! 20 seconds! Same plan! Get to the seawall! Cope with it! James, get the Bangalore to the wire! Fast! Everybody ready! Here we go! Drop the ramp! There's no cover! That was an order, goddammit! Drop it! Hopefully y'all enjoyed that footage. I really do like watching the um, clips they have for the video games. So then you basically, you, you really do know what the story is about. And you do get um, attached to the characters that way. But I'm going to actually fast forward the gameplay a little bit. I mean, if you don't think I should on the next video just comment on this video and say hey don't skip the game footage you can do this. Yes, but sir. I don't think y'all wanna just sit here and see oh, me Jesus. just do all this so I'm gonna skip the footage a little bit so here we go right about now. 
I'm just gonna give y'all some fast clips and tell you basically what's happening. So what we're doing now is connecting these two rods together and it's explosion to blow up the barbed wire fence. So there's the video of that. Then the next step that we have to do is we have to raid these bunkers. So here's me killing some Nazis which it's pretty good because Nazis are not good. So I shot that one in the butt if you missed it. You can rewind a little bit. But Okay. So yeah, basically all you have to do is raid bunkers and basically get the Nazis out so your troops can pass. Cause these people are making it really difficult for that to happen. So here's another clip. So basically now we're raiding another bunker. Throwing a grenade. And I don't know how that guy didn't die. Yeah, I like to give payback to Nazis. Very not great. Like, not great people at all. But, guys, if you like this channel, please turn off the notification and subscribe to it if you like it. And give it a thumbs up if you like what I do here. Um, if you have any tips for me, then tell me. Here's another one. So, we're getting another bunker. This is the last bunker that we have to do until the great thing that we're going to have to do. I'm not going to give it away, but it's it's pretty epic. Um, a lot of crap that happened. But if you have any suggestions on how I could make these videos a lot better or make better content, um, I will take note in it. I will write some stuff down and try stuff out. Since, you know, I am a new YouTuber, I don't know how to really, like, I know how to edit, but I don't know how to, like, make the content good. But, yeah, here's this little butt licker. Yeah. I thought y'all may want to see this gameplay. My friend, he tried to jump in and help the guy that was on the, the boat. And, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna have to kill this guy. Screw Nazis, really. Just screw them. Honestly, we should put them back in a, a chamber, if you know what I mean. Because really, it wasn't right for what they did. So, I do take pride in this. I don't condone violence, but this is what they had coming to them. Screw Hitler. <laughs> I can't walk. And fun fact, oh, did you know Hitler was actually an artist? I didn't know that yeah, until recently, everything. but I think this is going along together. But if you see right here, I have to drag my friend. He just got hurt, got stabbed actually. So I had to drag him, shoot off Nazis and stuff like that. And here's two Nazis coming. So... Thank God for teammates, because if anything else, my friend would have died, and I don't want that. He's a good guy. Okay, stay with me. Medic! I need morphine. Very touching. You gotta hang on. Those girls in Paris are waiting for you. Really? Of course they are. Yeah, my dude. You need to make it. How about another look at your girl? Huh? Huh? Oh, you kidding me? That's okay. I can't, I can't see shit. I'm just. I'm gonna rest right, right here. Very sad. I don't know. You have to stay awake. Hey! Daniels! I'm here! Help me. See, and the look in his man. eyes, man. He's so scared, and I don't. That's the one thing that I cannot do in war. I got is this. I don't know it just it's very hard and people that has PTSD this is why listen up there's a GPF cannon by the farmhouse up the road it's tearing up the beach let's move we'll come back for you check your ammo and grenades 
Okay guys, you're gonna see another split clip in about like three, two, one now. So right now I'm making my dream come true and getting some Nazis like get them out of here. So there they are, they're running away because screw Nazis and we're better. I've said screw Nazis like a bunch of times, but it's okay. One more won't hurt. Screw them. And if you haven't, if you don't know about thermite, very strong explosive, explosive stuff. Hit the hit the deck. There we go. Okay. So. There was another split clip if you caught it, and look who it is. Daniels. I, mean, I thought I'd seen everything. He gonna be all right? Yeah. He taped them up pretty good. Uh, should have stayed on the boat. Well, now he tells us. Hey, what you did back there, I owe you. I say we're even. We'll see this through. To the end. To the end. Beachhead secured. We'll bivouac at the second hedgerow after the ridge. Welcome to the bloody first. You're a long way from Texas, farm boy. Is that guy off a movie? I feel like he is. None of us could have prepared for that. No, sir. Came through when it counted. Thank you. Thanks, sir. Thank you a lot. You'll be all right, son. Mm, yes, sir. I hope so. I feel like we're the same age. Of course. But if I'm son, then you're dad. Simba. No, no. For ser seriously, though. PTSD. But guys, if you're new to my channel, please smash that like button. Subscribe to it. To and tell me what I can improve on. Thanks, guys. And I will see y'all soon. Peace.